Welcome guys, I'm gonna work on the Learn to Get Startups Airbnb course and today we're gonna build the link between those cards and the small tooltip on the map. So let's do this. So what I'm basically, that's my index page, which I don't need, that's my search page. This is where the map is displayed, as you can see here. And this is the list with the item components. So I'm gonna open it and you guys gonna see it. So that's, so first of all, I need to create an unclick event. Handle click. We're working in a component which is a function, a pure function. And I'm using well, the React hooks. For most of the part. So if I'm doing handle click, which is a function, and then list item click because we want to listen to my bad here. And if we go on the items, we can also do the same. Wait, I think Airbnb is doing it in the other way. You first of all click on the right to display on the left. Let's see. If I go to Paris, because Paris is beautiful during this weather. I wish you guys come here, but whatever. This is not what we're looking for. I'm gonna put my date, whatever it is. Let's see. So when you, oh no, it's only when you hover and look. See? So when I over it, I need. To highlight on the right. All right, let's do this. So on um, mouse move, <sighs> which is gonna accept the prop and uh, over. Super simple. Here, search on uh, over. Sorry. And then hover. Here you go. So let's see if it's working. We go here. See, it's working. It's a really good point. But I also need to tell which one is over. Otherwise, there is no point. Room. Let's be sure I'm getting the right information. See, so this is the right information. This is the list and I'm sure I'm gonna have an ID, there you go. So room listing ID, .id sorry my friend sometimes. Here you go. So what I want is that is active. Why I'm saying is active, it's because for every time the ID equal equal the room listing, oops, listing 
ID, it should be active. Marker is a component that I have, and let's see if it's working. Is active. All right, so let's see now. Yeah, first I need to create uh, overhead set overhead. This is what we called hook. This is new in React. But this is really cool. Let's say no. It's basically uh, the previous set states that we used to use. As of component, I don't need this. Set overhead. If. Okay, I'm gonna update only when the IT is different than the previous one because we captured a lot of movement since we are on the callback on mouse move and the out mouse move means every time the mouse is on the item it's going to capture an event so we make sure that we're not updating the state every time the mouse is moving on top of the item so let's do this set overhead id and here it's overhead and not id let's see see so we can see but i also need to capture I think I'm gonna do a mouse enter and on mouse leave. It's more granulate, I prefer this. On mouse leave. Um. On mouse enter. On mouse leave. On mouse and uh, here we go. It's gonna be much easier because then we can be here and say on mouse leave, on mouse and and the uh, mouse and uh, so for every time the mouse enter the div, we want to set the overhead ID to two and then basically cancel when we are leaving the div and they'll must leave and they'll must leave we don't need the room item same here I can just do this we're saving space there we go and I think now we're gonna have something a bit better. Whatever. I mean, the console log doesn't mean anything because we need here to say, so I'm setting the background on the arrow and the price. Background, background. So what I want to do it's here giving props to style components so I can switch the background color is active and same mm, sorry here so every time here so I'm gonna use the props Props is active. I don't know the color yet, so let's put green. 
things well he has leaned to do the job for me here so let's see if it's working see perfect it's working we need to adjust some stuff like the color if it's active we need to be like this and otherwise it's what the color is I guess black and we have to set up this here perfect now let's grab the color of Airbnb I guess it's this one please give me the color zero zero six RGB 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 there we go so now if we refresh we can see that it's like lighting like that like here but what when for example this one the tricky part is that right now we cannot see it which is fun but we also need to say something like we also need to work on the Z, the Z index so we can tell to be on top of all the markers. There we go. So if it's active, I would say let's go for, I guess, 10. Otherwise, it's zero. And it's then index, not in there. There you go. Boom. This is it. I linked. Um, something on the left. Well, I linked the on the different rooms with the list on the right, which is pretty cool. I kind of like it. Perfect. Bye, guys. If you want to um, get more videos like that, this is the first time for me. But if you want, you can uh, either follow me on Twitter or on learn to code startups.com. See you. Bye bye.